Future Earth can be a transdisciplinary program that will provide the scientific evidence to government, the private sector, civil society at large. How do we have growth that is much more sustainable in the future? We'll bring together the world's scientific community. We'll bring together also those that need to use this information. More than ever, the communication between science and society is nearly broken down. There's very little communication, just at a time when we need science more than ever to protect climate, to do something about water scarcity, to address the basic questions having to do with development. We need Future Earth to, in order to provide integrated solutions to the problems of global environmental change. And it's becoming clearer and clearer that you can't just fix one thing. We need to be able to approach problems in an integrated fashion, both in terms of not separating water, land and ecosystems because they all interact, but also not working on the social problems separate from the natural science problems. In order to really create a more sustainable earth, we need these more integrated interdisciplinary solutions, which is what Future Earth is trying to provide from the perspective of the scientific community. Well, science today can speak with one voice that the world needs a great transition to global sustainability, which is based on 30 years of incredible advancements in earth system science, showing that we may even have entered a new geological era, the Anthropocene, where humanity is simply putting so much pressure on the planet that we risk the modern economy as we know it. To solve this problem, we need new type of science that integrates social and natural sciences, and we need a new kind of step change in effort in understanding the risks humanity is facing, the impacts on people, but also focusing much more on the solutions for energy, for water, for a new economics in a world where global environmental change is actually affecting different communities, different businesses, and different nations. We live in very interesting times at the moment. Population is increasing. Within 30, 40 years, we will be almost 10 billion people. All those people need a home, need food, need a very, very nice life. So we need development. At the same time, you actually see that 80% of those people live in poverty. 20% use 80% of the resources. We see climate change, we see ocean acidification, we see a decline in biodiversity. I think we need Future Earth because the scientific community is asking for it and they're moving towards more integrated science. Um, we still have the very important fundamental science that leads to more integration, but we need a better mechanism to bring these communities together so they can work together more effectively. Why well, I'm excited about Future Earth, it's, it's, a, it's, it's a new way of doing science, of integrated science between the natural and social sciences uh, to, to address these crucial problems.